Sorry, baby, show me. What is up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Um, I just want to start this video off by thanking you guys for 600 subscribers. It's been a long grind the last almost five years to get here. I had a goal set by the end of the year to hit 1,000, and it looks like we're making good time, guys. So I'm very happy to have you know this great subscriber base on the channel. Thanks to all of you guys for all the support and all the stuff we've done here. And things are only going to get better from here. Our 600 sub special, we're going to be filming on Tuesday, as long as everything goes to plan. Uh, me and Hayden are going to be bringing back a car that you guys haven't seen on this channel in months. And uh, it's going to be fantastic to finally return the car back. Um, we've got a lot of cool stuff planned this year. Um, 2019 is just beginning for this channel. We started off rough with, down, with the downtime the truck had. And now it's just time to get everything back in shape. And 2019 is going to be one of the best years for the channel. So, I, I'm excited to bring that 200 sub special, that 600 sub special to you guys. Um, as long as everything goes to plan, that'll be up on Wednesday. Um, no, Friday. So stay tuned for that 600 sub special on Friday. Um, we're gonna, I'm going to be doing a POV video on the Mustang tomorrow. So first time driving the Mustang on video. So be sure to be out for that on Wednesday. It's going to be a fantastic video. We were originally planning on doing a video of Marshall today. Of course, uh, we've been having to deal with this because it's broken again. So it's been a little bit more difficult to actually um, get with him to shoot a video while we're trying to solve this. So, also, I want to talk about, and speaking of 1,000 subscribers, for 1,000 subscribers, I want to reveal a new car that I'm, work, I'm working on buying to you guys. I haven't bought the car yet, so don't be trying to like sneak and look around and be like, oh, Jordan bought a red car, Jordan bought a black car, you know. Um, I don't have the car yet, but by the time I hit 1,000 subscribers, uh, at least with my current growth rate, I should be able to buy this car. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, one the 4.0, if you don't already, go check it out. Um, that's where you can get behind the scenes, sometimes coverage on videos, sometimes random stuff like I posted about the weather ye or yesterday, uh, Saturday when I'm filming, or Saturday, so I'm filming this on Sunday. Um, <laughs> I mean, I literally post a bunch of random stuff on my Instagram, so if you guys don't already follow me on there, be sure to go ahead and do so because it's where you can see pictures of this guy, uh, behind the scene footage of my, my videos and all that stuff. Um, usually I do that behind the scenes on my story. So um, if you follow me on Instagram, you can check out my story. There's a chance you might find behind the scenes footage of the videos. So I, I'm, I'm excited to announce that guys. Uh, I, I've been thinking about it. You guys saw in the video where I drove the Equinox and uh, when this was well, low in oil, um, that I was thinking about retiring this to daily driver use and moving into a chassis that is more um, capable of, of high horsepower, a car that is smaller, a car that I could swap out with this and drive to school because this thing gets a solid 12 miles per gallon on a good day. So I want something that's a little bit better on gas that I can drive to school and be able to enjoy. So I wanted to get something that was also good on gas that I can have fun with. So if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you guys have seen my top four contenders. The EG Civic Coupe, the EG Civic, or the, a, the EJ Civic Coupe, the EG Civic Hatch, the 3000 GT and the Eclipse. So um, if you guys want me to do a video on why those top four in particular, I will gladly do a video on it. Uh, there's a reason why my original idea of getting a muscle car is no longer there. It's insurance. If, if unless I can get a steal of a quote, you know, under a hundred bucks on insurance for a Mustang or Corvette, then I can, I can justify it, but I can't, it's impossible. I'm 19, you know, the, the Mustangs I've been looking at, the majority of them are convertibles. Um, because the S2000s kind of spoiled me, maybe want a vert. So um, these cars will not, none of these will be convertibles that I'm looking at. Um, but they will be something completely new for this channel and will hopefully bring in more people to check out this channel and, you know, join the family, you know, join the family, like my description always says in these videos. So um, if you guys want me to do a video on why those top four cars, the two Civics, the 3000 GT and the Eclipse, I will gladly do one. Um, there's a couple things though. The 3000 GT will not be a VR4, so you do not expect that dual cam twin turbo motor on this channel. Those are way too expensive. Uh, the ones I can afford are the base models that are front wheel drive with a single overhead cam engine. So it's the one that's, it's the probably the least uh, buildable out of the group. I'll probably be right back to square one like I am in the 4.0, the 3000 GT, um, performance wise. So that's why it's more than like, it's like the least likely to happen out of the group. I would need to really find parts for the single cam motors to really justify said purchase on the 3000 GT. But yeah, if you guys want me to do a video on that, let me know. So let's get on to the truck. The truck's broken again. This time, thankfully, is nothing too serious. I mean, it could be serious for all I know, but I don't think it is. Um, it involves the front suspension. Pretty much what's been happening, anytime I take a turn to the right, 
Uh, I turn the wheel about that and it pops. I hear a pop sound and a like a slight vibration of the steering wheel. Not like a shaking, but I can feel the pop of the steering wheel. Um, I'll bring the, the camera over to the right wheel now. So we are at the front of the truck, so you might not be able to hear it because like I said, everyone's cutting the grass right now around me, so there is some, some sort of play in here. I don't know if that's a wheel bearing, a tie rod, uh, or a wheel bearing or a ball joint or something like that, so um, we're definitely going to try to figure it out because that's not good. Um, it's dangerous to drive on. I haven't driven this thing since I discovered it really, so yeah, it's been a few days since I drove this thing. So with all that said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this short little video. I just wanted to thank you all again for 600 subscribers. And uh, just keep your eyes out for this week's videos. I'll be driving the Mustang tomorrow. I'll be sure to do a POV video on that. Uh, we'll be doing a video with Marshall probably as soon as I get back to Florida next week. So uh, if you guys want me to vlog my trip next week, let me know. Uh, I plan on otherwise filming videos in advance. Uh, probably more sit down stuff for next week. Um, that way I can uh, upload said videos and be able to take a break and you know enjoy my uh, enjoy my uh, week in florida with my family uh but i plan on bringing the gopro as well the deep power whatever you want to call it to do uh go-kart videos because um, i do love go-karting it's one of my favorite things to do so uh we, I, we plan on doing that it's a tradition every year so um we're gonna have a lot of fun with that so uh with all that said guys hope you guys enjoyed stay tuned for the videos this week and i will see you guys next time <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah